Ah, yes. What's going on? So a lot of people do this thing called vlogging. And, well, I thought, why not do a vlog? Only my life ain't interesting. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to try this. Vlog. Oh, monologue. Kind of like Jay Leno has a monologue. Tries to be funny. Like observation. This is going to be called the first installment you're watching, by the way, of Tom Vlogomogs. Tom Vlogomogs. The Tom brand one. Vlogomogs. And t observational, obviously. And today, as I'm staring out the window here, I want to talk to you about the Weather Channel. Wow. I mean, TV has come a long way. We can watch so many channels now. But I'll tell you, I never saw this one coming when it came out years ago. The Weather Channel. When the Weather Channel hit TV, I thought, right, people are going to watch a channel about the weather? Next to watching the Perpetual Fireplace channel. You get it, that Perpetual Fireplace usually comes around during Christmas time. I can't think of a more boring concept for a TV program when this was coming out, obviously. Phone, don't go off. I'm too busy doing a vlog. Oh no, they say. People want to watch the weather. In fact, they want to watch the weather so much, we're going to repeat the same stuff every 20 minutes. Right, <laughs> right. Know what scares me most about the Weather Channel? You know what scares me most? I've actually started watching it. I did the great thing. I did. The great thing about the Weather Channel is not having to follow a story. I mean, that's probably why I'm such a reality sitcom buff. Not even reality sitcom. I don't even watch that. I really just watch sports, but I can't even tell you any sitcom that I follow on a weekly basis. It's too much. Too much effort. Too much time consuming. You gotta invest a lot when you're watching a series. You don't have to follow a story. Cloudy. With sunny periods. 60% chance of showers easy you can't get lost in the plot or confused about who did it in this story and then there's that catchy tune that starts every time the local forecast is coming your way get you alert I dive right in front of the TV when they hear that playing they talk about the rest of the country and the world for 20 minutes. Then that local forecast tune hits and you think, hey, we're on. Honey, honey, come quick. We're on TV. It's the local forecast. The fact that the Weather Network has succeeded really opens the door too, I think, in the upcoming years. Previously overlooked, such as previously overlooked channels are now being considered, like the Benjamin Moore channel. We can finally tune in to watch 
the paint dry. And the Pet Care Channel. Another idea. Don't miss this week's special. Flossing your cat's teeth. Fun for the whole family. But at least these channels have topics that change a little. The Weather Channel, though, stories are so limited, obviously. <laughs> They're so limited. There's rain, sun, cloudy, snow, and some storms. Then you've seen it all. But you're guaranteed to be to be watching reruns after that. So I imagine in the boardroom trying to come up with the other stuff to fill in the time and make the whole weather entertaining. The weather channel. A phenomenon. Easy to get addicted to. Nothing to follow. Greatness. Riveting. Trust me, watch it and you'll be hooked. You just can't get away from the TV. Now, if you excuse me, I am going to go pitch my idea for the Benjamin Moore channel. This has been your very first installment of Vlago Monologues or something to that extent. Until next time. Later.